Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to a really, really tiny video. Today we're going to be talking about the update that's literally just happened. It is version 0.7.13, or 0.7.13. Um, what they've added is winches, huge winches, uh, which has a cable length of 500 meters, which is pretty cool, and uh, it's buoyant as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys how big the winch is. Um, in, in, oh, I, I can't even think of the word, in comparison to my boat. So, um, this is the biggest boat that I've got on this laptop at the minute that is built by me. So, um, yeah, I'll show you guys how big the winch is on here and then we'll give it a quick go. Hey! Okay, so first things first, we need to get the winch. Okay, here we go. So these are the winches that we've currently got. We've got a small winch, which is the electrical winch. They've changed its name. Okay. Um, right here, we got the medium winch, which is the normal winch. Then we've got the large winch, and then we've got the huge winch. Okay. Um, so they've also all got fluid things as well. So they can all transport fluid through them. Um, so that means that they've actually removed the fluid... I can't... Uh, fluid hose? It was called a hose. Um, they've removed that, so that's no longer a thing. If you type in hose, nothing will come up. So, it's all done through the winches. Okay, so now that that's been said, we'll go ahead and get this winch, and I'll show you guys what it looks like. In fact, we're going to go ahead and put it on here anyway, uh, and we'll put it right at the back. In fact, we'll put it in the middle. <laughs> yeah, right in the middle. Um, so, here we go. We'll, we'll fit it wherever it can actually fit, and we'll put it... I mean, it could go at the back. Let's put it right at the back. Here we go. Uh, and we'll shove it right in there. Beautiful. Okay, so there's our little uh, our little winch, or our massive winch. Uh, in comparison to the other winch, um, it's it's this big. <laughs> okay, so this winch is tiny. That winch is actually really, really large. Uh, this one goes down to 100 meters. This one goes five times that to 500. So that's pretty good. That is pretty good. Um, also, the line from this is buoyant. So say if you put it in the water, it'll float unless you weigh it down. So let's go ahead and get a handle. Or, or something like that. There we go. We'll grab a handle and we'll put that on the end. And we'll see if it floats. Uh, we also need some buttons. Here we go. So that we can see if it actually works or not. And we can also do the speed and stuff like that as well. Uh, just to make sure it goes down fast. Etc, uh, etc. Et so they all need power. There we go. I don't know what the power usage is. Does it actually say anywhere on these things? What the power usage is? No. It doesn't. I wish it did say that somewhere. Because uh, that would be kind of useful. Anyway, we're going to go ahead and attach these to here. They've got the same things. So we got cable up and we got cable down. That is it. We've also got the winch length if we need it, which, um, you know, we kind of could. Let's get a dial and we'll see how long it actually goes out to. Presumably 500. It will go to 500. So we, we don't really have to worry about that. Uh, but we'll put it there anyway. All right, cool, good. Uh, it needs this. That, well, it doesn't really, but that's okay. And that's all good. Okay, where does the fluid go in, though? That's another question, isn't it? That is another question. If we can put this here on its side... It goes in the bottom. Okay, so the fluid goes in the in the bottom. If I put this here, and I flick it out sideways... Oh, there. There we go. So the fluid will go in here um, with a pipe. Okay. And it can be transported across. So that's pretty good. That is pretty good indeed. You can uh, do stuff with that. That's nice. Um, you can actually probably transport fluid. So like oil from one ship to another ship, which is 500 meters away, which is pretty good. And I guess you could attach a bunch of them together and go millions of miles. Um, yeah, like that would be kind of cool, actually. Anyway, let's go ahead and spawn it in and uh, we'll see if it works. Okay, so it does weigh quite a bit and uh, my boat doesn't uh, really sit up or stand up to it very well. Um, but it's the biggest boat I've got, and uh, we're going to have to go with it anyway, so that's, that's, that's fine. Um, yeah, okay, so, so far, so good. We're going to go ahead and start lowering it down now, and we'll see if it floats. Okay, so this one was down, I think. Yeah, there we go. See, it's floating, kind of. The rope has buoyancy, but it does have a little bit of weight on the end. Um, but yeah, you guys can see that it is actually floating, so that's good. Uh, we're at 40, or oh, we're at 50 already. <laughs> That is pretty good. That is pretty good. So we're going to leave that go out and we'll see how long it actually ends up being. Okay, so we're at 200 now. We are basically not able to see the end of it, so that's interesting. Uh, 250. Okay, we still can't see the end of it. We are slowly going around in a circle uh, because my boat is listing to one side. Basically, if you guys haven't watched the series yet, um, which you won't have because this video is going out tonight, 
I've got a bunch of videos ready for this series. Anyway, uh, if I do this, you guys can see a camera. This is for the medical bed, which uh, you can see right there. That's pretty cool. This means that you kind of don't, there's stuff down there, and then this is like a little camera room as well. If you do this, the camera turns on, and this seat controls the camera, which is pretty interesting. Pretty interesting indeed. We might be able to see the end of the, <laughs> the end of the rope. No, uh, no, no way. There's no way we could see the end of it, but you know, that's kind of cool to be able to see that stuff. Um, right, okay, it sounds like it stopped. 500, 500 meters. Awesome, that's pretty cool. So, if we stop this here, okay, if we stop this boat here, and then we go out and we try and find it, we'll try and find the end and we'll see, we'll see where it is. Bearing in mind that we have gone in a circle, so it won't be as long as it seems. Okay, we'll just grab this and we'll go. <laughs> okay, here we go. Get on board. Let's go. This is my little uh, rib in case you guys haven't seen that video series. Anyway, we're going. We're going. We are actually moving. All right, fantastic. Turn this off and we're out of here. So we gotta, we are really slow. <laughs> I, I forgot that it was this slow, but we should be faster than this. Uh, there's the boat over there that we've left uh, running. I don't know whereabouts we actually started dropping the stuff off. So we gotta go in a straight line a little bit and then we'll start turning towards it and we'll see. We'll see where the end is. Okay, so I've just set a waypoint on the boat. It is 700 meters away, so we gotta go a little bit closer to the boat anyway. Um, we are almost there. Also, I really need to make this thing faster before I actually upload it to the workshop or anything like that. Uh, cause this is so slow. <laughs> this is really, really slow. Anyway, it's an emergency. Turn on the emergency flashy lights. There we go, look at that. There's the end. I can see the end. It's right in front of us. Okay, cool. So as soon as we get pretty close to this, we should be able to stop. Here we go, start stopping. There we go. So the end of it is weighed down by the handle, as you guys already knew, kind of. Here we go. And it is actually weighed down quite a bit. It's at the bottom of the ocean, apparently. That's cr It might have snagged on something. We, we don't know. I am dying. It's that deep that I'm dying. Um, but yeah, it is really, really long. There we go. It's at the bottom of the ocean. Hot diggity dog. That's crazy. That is really long. But yeah, anyway, that is pretty much it for the update. There's a bunch of fixes that's happened as well. But um, for right now, I'm going to go ahead and say thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this random video with large winches. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.